Vanier is, in my opinion, les études sont faites en, en anglais, mais life at Vanier, c'est complètement bilingue. Yeah. And, yeah. and that's what makes, I believe, our, our program special. Did you, uh, when you, when you got there uh, as a head coach, um, well, uh, at that time, what else did, had you invented? Well, what I saw was, what I saw was the problem at Vanier, and they hadn't won there for 17 years, was that the players were there just to try to get a scholarship to go to the NCAA because the previous coach was, he was pushing that narrative. Now, we still do that, but it's not the primary thing that we talk about when, I'm, when we're recruiting players. So uh, I can remember an early practice in training camp. One of the players had a friend that was in the stands filming practice or fil filming a game for himself. But we have our film guy. But he wow. wanted film just for him, specialized for him. Just for fun, film with uh, yeah, with not a cell phone. There is no cell phone. No, in those days it was a video. Yeah, yeah. 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 So, <laughs> so <laughs> he would. Exactly. So this is. this was what was happening. So when I got my first meeting with all the players, I could I could see that there was a cultural problem at Vanier. My yeah. first meeting, quatre vingt percent de les jours il dit à moi. Man, CVM, he said, so this, CVM does this, because at that time, CVM was winning the Bold Doors almost every year, yeah, yeah, exactly, right? Yeah, exactly, every other year. So, psychologically, they were already defeated. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, what I had to do is I had to bring in leader guys, guys with strong personalities. And I had to make a distinct decision We were going to be different from them. The way we approached the game, the way we handled the academics, the way we recruited, the way we spoke to them. We were, CVM was here, Vanya was here. 180% are completely, completely different. Yeah. That was the only way that I could make sure that I was getting the type of player that I wanted, but also the players could see the difference and decide. Yeah, I like this environment better, or I like that environment better. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that was that was what I did at the beginning, and it was you know believe yeah. me when they say uh, growing pains and culture change, there was a lot of pushback yeah. from the veterans in their first year. Mm -hmm. They didn't like it. Did you have a lot of players quit? No, I had a lot of players that I cut. Oh yeah, okay. You oh actually yeah. Cut yeah, they didn't quit. I cut them. Oh yeah. Yeah. You're not gonna be no. required here. Yeah. Thank you. And that was my mon premier année, c'est 2004, and we were quatrième place, mm. and we lost in the first round of the playoffs. Mon deuxième année à, à Vanier, we went all the way to the Bull Door, and we lost a game that we could have won against CVM mm -hmm. dans 2005. 2006, on gagné le bol d'or. 2007, on gagné le, le bol d'or. 2010, 2012. Okay. And the last three years, we've been to the bol d'or twice now that I've become full time again. Mm -hmm. You know, I started full time dans 2017 and we were the f finalists and 2019 encore yeah. finalists. Yeah. A little bit disappointed with that, but you know, uh, <laughs> yeah. it's a, it's a, again, I had to take the program. It was here, it had come down a little bit, and now it's moving back up in the right direction.